Hey, what is going on everybody? My name is Strictly here with another video on my channel and I just want to sincerely apologize because I have not uploaded nearly two months now. Oh my gosh, it's such a long time and I want to get back into it. And I'm so glad you guys have stayed here and stayed subscribed to my channel. It's amazing what you guys have been doing for me. Watch my videos even though I haven't uploaded. It's amazing and I want to thank you guys so much for that. But I'm going to show you guys another art video today, but let's get right into the video. Alrighty guys, to start this off, I'm going to show you guys how to lower the platforms on any Quetzal or Raft or pretty much anything like this. As you guys can see, the foundations are actually lower than the inside of the, uh, I don't know how to explain it, but the foundations are lower than the Quetzal platform, as you guys can see, and you can literally get on your Quetzal from inside. This is awesome for raiding. If you guys are trying to raid somebody or something. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to lower it on a raft. You guys can also use the same method. Say if you're trying to build on a Quetzal or a Moza. Whatever you guys want to build on that has a platform saddle. Or something that you can pretty much lower. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what to do here. I'm going to go ahead and pop a raft into the water. I'm Just bring concrete pillars or foundations or stone, whichever you guys prefer. I'm on Primitive Plus, so I'm using stone or concrete, but you guys can pretty much use metal. It doesn't really matter. You guys can use statue if you really want to, just whatever you prefer. So I'm going to go ahead and place down this raft. I'm going to try to hide the cell for you guys so it's not in the way. But I'm going to go back into the Quetzal, and once I go back into the Quetzal, you're going to want to grab your foundations and pillars. And once you do that, you're going to want to go back over to your raft or Quetzal platform or Moza platform, whatever it's really called, or whatever you're building on. Just go ahead and grab the pillars and foundations. I'm just going to put in my hot bar so it'll be easier to access. But, um, yeah, once you guys get this in your hot bar, I'm just going to walk out of my Quetzal and I'm going to go back down to the raft to show you guys what to do next. Alrighty guys, once you are now at the raft, all you're going to want to do is pretty much, I want to show you guys a little trick. If you press Y on the raft or E or whatever, and if you hold out a pillar like this, it'll center the pillar for you. I know a lot of you guys have problems centering pillars like this, but look at that, it's perfect. I'm just going to move it in a little bit and see, it's completely centered guys. It is amazing and I'm loving this. I did see this trick off at a, a different channel, I'm not sure what they're called, I apologize. But um, this is a very nice trick. It's completely centered now. So all you guys want to do is just place a foundation. Simple as that. As you guys can see, it's pretty high up on the raft. From there, all you guys want to do is demolish that pillar, or place another pillar, and then demolish this pillar, and then place another foundation right next to it. And if you guys see, it's like glitching out a little bit lower and stuff like that. See, right there. And as you guys can see, it slowly goes lower and lower. Just place another pillar in that, demolish this one, so we can get this one out of the way. And then we place another foundation, and it goes lower again. Unfortunately, I think it messed up one of these times. I don't know why, but I usually like doing it on the corners. It's a lot easier, but um, I guess I'm just going to have to replace this or something. Just place another pillar in the middle, and just demolish this one again. I guess it bugged out or something. But just put another foundation down. I suggest you guys bring about 30 foundations, I would say. Or 20 or something, however much you really want to lower it. But you guys will be able to place boxes, walls, everything you really want to on top of this. And as you guys can see, it's starting to get lower and lower into the platform of the raft. And I will soon be getting there to the point where it will be glitching into the raft. And you guys will literally be able to press Y on it to get on the raft. I think it's one more after this. And you guys will see that I can, I don't have walls on me. I didn't have walls on me at the time when I was building this. But as you guys can see, it pretty much goes into the raft, which is absolute. Oh my God. Hello. How are you doing today? Um, pike, 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 pike. I hate these freaking things. What is it doing? Oh, <laughs> wow. Uh, that, that's the advantage of living near a swamp, guys. You get cappers eating you alive every single day. Bring a pike with you. Just go ahead and demolish this foundation. And once you guys demolish this one, you guys can literally place it all around. You guys can skip out the middle one if you don't want to place anything there. That will give you an extra foundation, which I just placed. Because I'm not going to place too much crap on this raft. But it's 
pretty much just gonna be a little dino pin sort of thing. And as you guys can see, you can literally press Y on it and ride around just like you normally would. But I hope you guys were able to understand what I was talking about. I know I'm a bit terrible at explaining things, but hopefully you guys were able to explain, or hopefully I was able to explain this to you guys well. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video, and if you guys did want to enjoy, hit that like and subscribe if you guys are new, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace.